the self storage units you self manage, correct? Yes, yes. So and, and I self -manage. manage with relative ease, from what I recall, at least past conversation. Yes. Yeah, so I have one here that I acquired in October 2020, and it's less than two hours away. So it's not like I can jump in my car and and uh, you know visit it every day. Um, I mean, I could if I needed to, but it's not like five minutes away where I can go check on it. So with technology these days and the systems and setting it up right from the beginning, a lot of it can be managed remotely because it's it's not very management intensive. Um, the website, um, you can lease, look at the uh, available units, the prices, uh, manage your payments online. We have uh, a call center that answers the phones. I'm actually switching that now to actually have more of the phones come to me now so I can get a better uh, grip and, and even squeeze it a little bit more because it's my facility. I, I'll, I'll know uh, what I can do, what options, rather than if it's a call center, they you know they can, I, they can only do so much. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. And the place is pretty much 96% full, so it's not getting a lot of calls. But th th there's a capabilities out there that, I mean, even... Uh, smart key locks are out there. So as long as you have, you still need some boots on the ground, some local good boots on the ground, which I'm lucky to have. I have uh, two people over there that, you know, I can text, call, and, and uh, they can be at the facility probably within five minutes. So um, just like some of the other guests mentioned, um, you, you, because property manage it, I think uh, uh, throughout this entire show, we'll, we'll, we'll kind of understand that as being one of the most important pieces, at least long term. Um, you've got, even though you may, you're very active in the management still, even though you're far away, you have boots on the ground for the Johnny on the spot, whether it's a handyman or, or, or some type of assistant that can address issues as needed as they come up. Is that, is that what I'm Yes, understand? correct. Okay. Cause you're going to have those uh, instances where I'm having trouble with the door. I need somebody to go there or you need yeah. the, the AC guy. There's the AC, uh, something happened with the AC or. Um, you know, it's, you gotta have somebody that that's responsible and responsive that you can, that you can trust. Um, you, you named a few tools. So no, like, so technology allows this, like, you know, 20 years ago, you wouldn't, it's not that you couldn't do it and investors, you know, they did invest out of state at that time too. It just, it's so much easier for just ordinary folks that we don't have billions of dollars and lots of staff in multiple states, like we can invest in different markets with ease. So well, you mentioned a couple of the tools. What are some of the primary tools that you're using to effectively manage both the experience from the client side or the customer side, but also your end for data, financial, uh, just tracking, security? Well, yeah. So one of the main tools is is finding a good uh, self storage um, management software, which is also my website. So it's you know a vendor. I mean, I use C Easy Self Storage. So that really they have a so great Easy platform. Self Storage is is the title. Easy Self Storage is actually okay. the Easy Self Storage Solutions. They manage the website, which is also the CRM or your uh, management tool. Because mm -hmm. it gives you all the reports, but it also gives you the ability to look at your dashboard. It also gives the ability for people to sign up online, look at your facility, manage their account online, um, you know, purchase the additional insurance. There's texting back and forth. There's you can be on a waiting list. It, it really, I mean, it's. It sounds like that's a full suite. Like if you're if you're in self storage, like that, that's something you need to look pretty hard into. Yeah, I can just say go to the website, and uh, I mean it's it's easier to do that than for me to do it over the phone w with the person on the phone, and um, because it has a map, it shows you exactly where your your unit will be if, yeah. if you choose that unit. You know, it's because we have two buildings, and um, yeah, that's 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 a game changer right there. I mean, it, it's uh, mobile friendly, so I can pull it out of my phone anytime and. Uh, and it works. It works really well. It also has the access control in there, so I can control the doors, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, letting people in or locking people out.